If you've been on YouTube for any amount of time, you've seen flashy on-screen captions. They keep people watching, make your message clearer, and even boost your engagement. But Opus Clip has heard the claims and read the comments that all Opus Clip captions look the same. And if you're using the default settings, your captions might blend in with other content creators. When your captions stand out, they help you get better engagement by making your messaging pop and helping more people stop scrolling and paying attention. Unique captions can help your content be recognizable. Again, people can tell when it's Opus Clip, so let's help them know when it's uniquely yours. The good news? You don't have to stick with the default style. I'll show you how to change it, make it your own, and save it as a template so every clip fits your unique style and brand perfectly. So while Opus Clip is an amazing AI tool that helps creators turn long-form content into viral clips, standing out is still key. Here's some ways to make your captions unique and stand out in just a few steps. First, let's go ahead into Opus Clip. On the left-hand side, select Brand Template. Here are the caption settings, and this is where the magic happens. Let's start customizing. Let's start with font. You want to choose one that matches your brand. In fact, you can upload up to 10 different fonts to Opus Clip. Opus Clip lets you save different caption styles for different formats. So you can have a caption style for 9x16 vertical videos such as shorts, reels, and TikToks. You can have a unique style for one-to-one -one or square for Instagram and Facebook feeds or 16x9, which is what this video is in, wide for YouTube and presentations. This means that you can have bold, fast-paced captions for YouTube shorts and sleek, minimal captions for widescreen videos all saved and ready to go within Opus Clip. To do this, we're gonna customize our captions for each different format. Then, we're gonna save them as separate templates and apply them instantly whenever we create new clips. This means less work for you and I as creators and a consistent branded look for our audience no matter where they're watching. Next, we're gonna select the layout that works for you. If you're a gamer, you can select gameplay. If you're a solo creator or have a screen share, click that. We even have options for guests. For layout, I'm gonna stick with the original. Then, under captions, we have even more options. You can start from a preset style here and customize it to your liking, or you can just go ahead and make your own. I personally like one line at a time, and for caption positions, I'm gonna go ahead and select auto. For animation, pick which style works for you. For this template, I'm gonna pick this one. Continuing on with colors, be sure to use complementary colors for contrast. Then, for text size and animation, be sure to keep it readable and dynamic. In fact, here's a bonus tip. You can use shadows and outlines to make your text pop without looking over-edited. When it comes to your captions, they not only should look good, but they should also engage your viewers. To do this, use bold words to emphasize key moments. You can do this with the AI keywords highlighter. Play with highlight colors to match your branding. Keep text positioning consistent so it's easy to follow. Then when you're done, select Save Template. You can copy a template, change the aspect ratio from 9x16 to 16x9, and now you have the same style in a different aspect ratio. And you can see where your styles are saved. To apply these templates to an existing video in Opus Clip, go ahead to the editor and select the template of your choice. Confirm that you want to switch to that template, and then Opus Clip will add your new look. So now you know, Opus Clip captions don't have to look like other creators, you can have your own unique style. We really encourage you to try these tweaks, save your templates for each format, and help let your clips stand out from the crowd. Do you want to learn more about Opus Clip? Check out that video on screen. I'm Andrew Cannon, I just wanted to thank you for watching and Opus Clip for having me.